Hello, Gary Hernandez here, and welcome to Kane Self-Defense with Master Gary Hernandez. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get somebody off you when they've got you pinned up against the wall, and they've got your shoulders locked back pretty good, where you can't get good punches in, and maybe you have a bad knee where you can't get a good knee strike. So I'm going to show you how to use your cane as a leverage pulling system, and giving me a hand is going to be Mr. Bob. <clears throat> I've got my cane in my hand, someone's got me pinned. They got me by the shoulders pinned, and it might be a lot bigger, stronger, and I can't do much. One of the things I'm gonna do is turn my cane. Now I'm gonna shoot it up like I just right here, and I'm gonna hook the neck. Once I hook the neck, I'm gonna hold this arm right here. And what I'm gonna do is, because the wall's behind me, I don't wanna pull up high, and I wanna pull up to where it's perfectly horizontal. I'm gonna pull downward. As I pull, I'm gonna push, and I'm gonna ram his head into that wall just like that. And then I can pull out my good strike. Let me show you again. He's got me pinned. He's good, he's holding me strong. I simply hike my cane up, hook the neck, and you can do this really fast. I don't wanna go super fast because this is gonna hurt Mr. Bob's neck. And once I got that neck hooked, I'm here. And again, I'm gonna pull, turn, and into the wall he's gonna go. Now let me show you. Right. Come on over here. Into the wall he's into gonna the go. Wall he goes. <laughs> it's a hard wall. So when he's got a hold of me, one of the things, I, when I do that, I hike up the cane just enough to hook that neck. Now, the wall was behind me, so I don't want to go like that because I'm going to hit it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull kind of between me and him. That's to make sure the cane doesn't hit the wall. See how he's already starting to go? I'm going to use this other hand as I'm pulling, I'm pushing, and I'm stepping. That's going to turn. Then I'm going to unhook him and then I can strike him. So again, once he's, I'll show you this angle, then we'll do the wall again. He's here, I hike it up, and I don't even have to lift my shoulders. This is, and you would do this on the faster side. You would swing it, and if you hit him, oh well, that's just as good. But catch, hook, from here, pull, there's that leverage pull. This can push upward, turn, and there he goes, into the wall. Now, when he's got me pinned, so once I do this and hook him, like I said, I'm hitting the wall right here. <clears throat> so pull, between, turn, <clears throat> and into the wall he goes. So make sure you're not hitting the wall. So you cannot pull it straight back. You can't pull it up because it's not gonna give you that leverage pull that you want. You must bring it down between you and him pull and turn and smack it into the wall then unhook it and then do what you may have to do so practice that technique as i always say make it yours hopefully that helps gary Hernandez, thank you and i will see you guys very soon